And at five today with a very disturbing story. The Polk County Sheriff says of all people, Dr. Gail Nichols here should have known better. She's a veterinarian, and tonight she's accused of animal cruelty, 40 animals in all, taken from her and her husband's farm in Lakeland. Most of them are miniature horses. And Fox 13's Ken Suarez is at Polk Animal Control, where they are now. And Ken, it's so sad, but I've heard that at least three minis had to be put down. They were in that bad condition. Yeah, you know, bottom line is this. You're a horse lover. I am. So many people are. And even if you are not, you can appreciate how heart-wrenching this story is. As she said, three had to be put down. Two, because their hooves were so neglected, they curled up, and there was just no hope for them. Another one, because that little one had a medical problem. According to the folks here at the sheriff's office, they said that could have been treated, but was not, despite the fact that Dr. Nichols is a practicing veterinarian. Imagine what it was like to walk on hooves so neglected they curled up like elf shoes. Hope Horse Rescue founder Danny Horton can only guess how long they went untrimmed. That's years. That yeah. can be year, years plus. It wasn't the only problem at Winsome Acres on West Bella Vista just outside Lakeland. Somehow wire got wrapped around the leg of another little horse. Untreated, the skin grew right over it. An animal investigator said the pain must have been a 10. The bone in the foot had disintegrated. She said it would be like your foot being gone and you trying to walk on the nub of your leg. And all three miniature horses had to be put down. Investigators blame Dr. Gail Nichols for ignoring the obvious. She's a veterinarian. She knows better. Nichols was just arrested as well as her husband, Paul Smith. Detectives say Nichols lived in one trailer on the farm, Smith in another, because they couldn't live in their house anymore. Cages, clutter, no air conditioning, rats running every place, rat nest in the air conditioning vents. However, it was home for the couple's dogs, crated several without water. After someone tipped off the sheriff's office to what was going on here, detectives seized eight dogs, 28 miniature horses, two full-sized horses, and two parrots, now being cared for at Polk Animal Control. A judge will eventually decide if Nichols and Smith get them back. We see horrible neglect, horrible abuse, and I ask you, if you were one of the animals, would you want to go back there? It's unclear if Nichols will be going back to work. She's employed part-time at Gulfport Veterinarian Clinic and Animal Emergency at Pasco, where she took care of other people's pets. But according to investigators, apparently at home, did not take care of her own. You know, this is not the first time that Dr. Nichols has been arrested in 2005. She was charged with abusing a disabled adult. That's now been knocked down to a lesser charge. Cynthia? Yeah, I'm still shaking my head like everybody else today, too. So, Ken, I know you'll stay on the story to let us know what happens. Thank you. Yeah.